Alice's Adventures in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll is filled with whimsical language and playful word usage, making it a fun way to learn English. Here are some words from the story that you can explore. Uh, one, curious. Context. Alice frequently describes things as curious or strange. Meaning, eager to learn or know something. Example, Alice was curious about what was behind the door. Two, caterpillar. Context. The caterpillar is a character who speaks to Alice while smoking a hookah, meaning the larval stage of a butterfly or moth. Example, the caterpillar asked Alice, who are you? Ash 3. Context. The Mad Hatter and the March Hare are described as mad, meaning crazy or insane. Example, the Mad Hatter hosted a tea party full of nonsense. 4. Grin text. The Cheshire Cat is famous for its wide grin. Meaning, to smile widely is often showing teeth. Example, the Cheshire Cat's grin was the last thing Alice saw as it disappeared. 5. Tea Party in Text Alice attends a mad tea party with the Hatter and the Hare. Meaning, a social gathering where tea is served. Example, the tea party was chaotic, with everyone talking at once. 6. Tart The Queen of Hearts accuses someone of stealing her tarts. Meaning, a small pie with a filling often sweet. The queen shouted, Who stole my tarts? R riddle Context The Mad Hatter asks Alice riddles during the tea party, meaning a puzzle or question meant to be solved. The Hatter asked Alice a riddle, Why is a raven like a writing desk? 8. Wonderland Context The fantastical world where Alice finds herself, a place full of marvels or extraordinary things. Example Alice couldn't believe the strange things she saw in Wonderland. Number 9. Dormouse. Context. The sleepy dormouse joins the tea party. Meaning, a small rodent that is often sleepy. Example, the dormouse kept nodding off during the conversation. 10. Rabbit hole. Context. Alice falls down a rabbit hole into Wonderland. Meaning, a deep, complex, or strange situation one enters by accident. Example, Falling down the rabbit hole led Alice to a world she never imagined. These words provide a good balance of whimsical, everyday, and character-based terms. As you explore the story further, you'll encounter more words that are playful or metaphorical, which adds to the fun of learning English through Alice's Adventures in Wonderland.